Amen. 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 Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Father, for your faithfulness. Thank you, Father, for your mercy. This is the day that you have made. Lord, we bless you. We honor you. We give you praise. Thank you, Father, for your faithfulness. Thank you for the hour of incense. God, thank you for the hour of prayer. God, we thank you. God, we honor you. We bless you. We give you the praise. We love you, Father. We thank you. We bow before your throne. We bow before your, you, God. For you are worthy to be praised. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. We give you the praise. We give you the praise. Thank you, Father, for your faithfulness. You are worthy to be praised. There is none like you. Thank you for a day that you have made. This is the day that the Lord has made. Lord, we rejoice. We are glad today. We bless you. We honor you. Thank you, Lord. Thank you for your faithfulness. In the mighty name of Yeshua. Thank you, Lord. In Yeshua's mighty name. Amen and amen. God bless you. Thank you for uh, coming out to pray with me this morning. I believe that this is the day that the Lord has made and we shall rejoice and we shall be glad in it. This is the day of the Lord and this morning we are going to be praying. We are going to be covering our day in prayer. We are going to be commanding our day. Amen. So that's what we are doing this morning. So let us start by thanking God. Father, we just want to thank you for this very moment. We thank you for waking us up. We thank you for the gift of life. We thank you, Lord, that you are the God who has made us. We have not made ourselves. Father, we thank you that you are fighting for us. We thank you, Lord, that you are with us. We thank you, Lord, that the gate of hell shall not prevail against us. Lord, we bless you. Lord, we honor you. Father, we want to start our day with prayer. Father, we commit our day, God, to you, God. Father, we thank you that you are in our day. We thank you, Lord, that you are fighting for us. We thank you, Lord, that you are our defender. Lord, we bless you. Lord, we honor you. We give you the praise. We give you the honor. Lord, we are committing our day to your hands. Lord, we pray that you will open up the heavens over us. Even, Lord, as we will leave our homes, God, to go to our various places, God, to go to the marketplace, God, Lord, we are asking, Lord, this money that you will guide us. Lord, we are asking this money, God, that, Lord, there will be miracles, God. Lord, we are asking this money that mighty things will begin to happen in our lives in the mighty name of Yeshua. God, we pray that this money that you will begin to turn every impossible situation, God, to possible, God. Lord, we pray, Father, that you will deal with our enemies this morning in the name of Yeshua. Lord, we bless you. Lord, we honor you. We command our day. Lord, we speak to the womb of this day. We declare the glory of God today. We pray for the mercy today. God, we declare your mercy. We declare your truth. We pray for strength. We pray for boldness. Lord, we cast down the works of the enemy. Lord, have your way. Father, let your will be done. Lord, I declare, let us have a blessed day today. I pray for a productive day today. In the name of Yeshua. Lord, on our job in our business God I pray for blessing I pray for blessing Lord I pray for your blessing to come upon your people in Yeshua's mighty name people of God I wanted to share something from the book of Joshua chapter 1 this is what Joshua we have been speaking before I took a break because I was off you know from this prayer for like a week and before I took a break uh, from praying early in the morning you know, I, I, as, as I've been talking about the blessing, our blessing. And Joshua chapter 1 says, I'm going to read Joshua chapter 1, 7. Say, it said, only be strong and very courageous that you may observe to do according to all, according to all the law which Moses, my servant, commanded you. He said, do not turn from it to the right hand or to the left, that you may prosper wherever you go. Amen. So Moses, the Lord was saying to Joshua after the death of Moses, that the Lord, that God, the Moses, have, God has given to Moses, that Joshua should not turn, compromise that law. Amen. And that is the same thing to us this morning. You know, we have the word of God with us and we cannot compromise the word of God because it is in, it is in us being faithful to the word of God that we will prosper. Amen. So that's why we are, we have to be people of the word of God. 
We have to be people who is always studying the word, who is always reading the word, who is always meditating on the word because our prosperity, our success is it, uh, hangs on us the way we handle the word of God. Amen. And verse 8 says, This book of the law shall not depart from your mouth. You shall meditate in it day and night, that you may observe to do according to all that is written in it. Amen. So our success hang on the word of God. We, like I said, we have to be people that that uh, people of the word of God. We have to meditate. You know, we have to read the word of God because our success. So that's why early in the morning, I want to encourage you to to seek the Lord. You know. To worship God, to, to, to seek after God, you know, early in the morning. Amen. He says, for then you will make your way prosperous and then you will have good success. Amen. So now for, for us to have good success, it means that we have to be people of the world. We must know the word of God. We must study the word. We must meditate on the word. Amen. That is how we are going to have good success. Amen. So I just wanted to share that with you this morning that, you know, Know, don't don't allow the business of life you know uh, to take away the time that you should be having you know in fellowship in the word of god amen make it a top priority to wake up early in the morning and to study god's word and to meditate on the word of god because it is you you meditating in the word of god that is going to cause your way to prosper you know the business ideas you have the business that god is giving you, the company that you have the job that you have you know whatever it is that you have it is you when you when you allow the word of god in you and you are faithful to God's word, that is how that you're going to cause yourself to be prosper. So this morning we are going to be speaking the blessing of the Lord over us this morning. Amen. So Father, we want to thank you, God, because your word declared to us that when you when we med meditate on your word day and night, that it will cause our way to prosper and we shall have good success. Father, I am asking this morning that you will begin to release the grace for your people, that they will be people of your word, that they will be faithful to your word. Lord, I come, we come against the attack of the enemy. God, every spirit of sputter, every spirit of deep sleep that will not allow your people to God to, to be people of your word. Lord, we come against that spirit of, of slumber, that spirit of deep sleep in the name of Yeshua. I declare this morning that your people will be people of your word, that they will read your word. God, there will be desire for your word in the name of Yeshua. Lord, we speak to our day today. We command our day. We pray for the glory of the Lord today. We pray for the blessing of the Lord today. We declare that our day is blessed. We declare today that we are prospering in the name of Yeshua. We declare that the works of our hands are blessed. We declare God our business is blessed in the name of Yeshua. We declare that because of us, our job is blessed in the name of Yeshua. Even those who are on our job, God, they are blessed because of us, because your blessing is on us. Lord, I am asking this morning in the name of Yeshua, God, that you will begin to strengthen your people in the marketplace and declare that the gate of hell shall not prevail against them. Lord, I am asking for spiritual awakening this morning that you will begin to wake your people up in the name of Yeshua. God, wake them up spiritually. Give them wisdom. Give them understanding. Lord, we cast down the works of the enemy in the mighty name of Yeshua. We declare breakthrough today. We speak to the womb of this day. We command our day is blessed. We declare that today we are blessed. Today God we pray for favor. Today God we pray for good success in the mighty name of Yeshua. God we declare that we will have good success today. In Yeshua's name, we declare that your people will have good success today. In the mighty name of Yeshua. Father, we thank you, Lord, that this is the day that you have made. Lord, we shall rejoice. We shall be glad today, God, because the Lord has made this day. This is the day of the Lord. God, we speak to the womb of the money. We declare your glory. God, we command our day. We pray for good success today. We pray for doors to be open to your people, God. In 
in the name of Yeshua. God, we speak to our finances, God. We pray that whatever needs to be healed in our lives, uh, God, in our finances, in our body, God, I am speaking this morning that let your people be healed. Let your people be delivered. Let them be set free today. God, give them wisdom. God, give them favor. God, be with them today, God. Lord, let their day be productive, God, in the mighty name of Yeshua. We declare the glory of the Lord today. We speak to the womb of the day. We pray for the mercy of God today. We pray for a breakthrough. God, we command our day. God, we declare glory. God, we pray that your will be done. God, we pray that you will defend us today. You will be with us. You will fight for us in the mighty name of Yeshua. Lord, your word declared that it shall come to pass because we have diligently obeyed the voice of the Lord our God to obey carefully all his commandments which he has commanded us that the Lord our God will set us high above all the nations of the earth I am declaring over you today in the name of Yeshua that the Lord God Almighty because you have obeyed the voice of the Lord because you have obeyed his word that the Lord will set you high above all the nations of the earth in the name of Yeshua and all these blessings all the blessings shall come upon you and overtake you I declare today because uh, you have taken the word of God seriously that the blessing of the Lord shall come upon you and overtake you in the name of Yeshua we declare that no sickness uh, no disease shall have any place in your home shall have any place in your body because you are blessed uh, you are not cursed uh, you are blessed in the name of Yeshua we declare that your body is blessed uh, in the name of Yeshua the work of your hands are blessed uh, in the mighty name of Yeshua your profession are blessed. We declare today that our career is blessed in Yeshua's mighty name. Father, because we have obeyed the voice of the Lord, our God, we are blessed in the city. You will be blessed in the city because you have obeyed the voice of the Lord, your God, this morning. You will be blessed in the city. Blessed you, uh, shall you be in the country. The fruit of your body is blessed. The produce of your ground is blessed. And the increase of your herd and the increase of your cattle and the offspring of your flocks are blessed in the name of Yeshua. Your household, the entire Entire household is blessed. Your your your. Y- your household is blessed God, God we thank you today that you are blessing us God we give you the praise Father we love you God we honor you. God blesses our basket and knitting bowl. We are blessed when we come in and we are blessed when we go out. I declare over you today in the name of Yeshua that as you come in and as you go out, you shall be blessed in the mighty name of Yeshua. The Lord will cause your enemies who rise against you to be defeated before your face. You, They shall come against you one way and they shall flee seven ways. The Lord will command the blessing on you in, in the storehouses and in all to which you set your hand and he will bless you in the land which Lord your God is giving you. Wherever you live, wherever city, wherever nation you live, God will bless you. God will cause his blessing to rest upon you in the name of Yeshua. I am declaring over you today that the Lord will open the good treasure, the heavens to give you rain for to your land in his season. I declare the heavens to be open over you. I declare good treasure to be open over you in the name of Yeshua. I declare that God will cause it to rain on your land in his season and the Lord will bless the work of your hand in the mighty name of Yeshua. Father, we thank you. Father, we bless you. We give you praise. We give you honor. We command our day. We declare that our day is blessed today. We declare prosperity today. God, we declare favor. We declare open heaven. God, we declare breakthrough. You are the God of the breakthrough. God, begin to break your people out of nothing. Not break, break them out of sickness. Break them out of lack. In the name of Yeshua, we command every powers of sickness, every influence of the devil, it Against your people, God, let the, the powers of sickness and disease be broken of your people this morning. In the name of Yeshua, we declare the glory of God. We pray for favor. In the mighty name of Yeshua, Father, we bless you today. 
We give you praise. Father, we pray for promotion. God, we pray even, God, that you will bless because of us, God, that you will bless, God, those who on our job. God, bless them. God, bless them in Yeshua's name. Father, we pray that you will make us to be stronger than our enemy. God, make us to be stronger than any situation that your people are dealing with today. God, I pray for wisdom, that you will give your people wisdom to deal with their situation today in in the name of Yeshua, that your people will always prosper. Your people will always excel in the name of Yeshua. We declare we are blessed. We declare we are blessed. We declare we are blessed. We are not cursed in the name of Yeshua. We declare the favor of the Lord in Yeshua's mighty name. Father, we bless you this morning. Father, we honor you. God, we come against every evil plot. We come against every attack of the enemy against your people. God, we pray, God, that you will be with your people. You will bless their day, God. God, I pray, God, in Yeshua's name. And Lord, we declare that as we are the ambassador of Christ, we are ambassador of peace. Father, we declare this money as we leave our home to go, God, to our, to go to the marketplace, God. As an ambassador of Christ, I declare that the, our words will bless those we encounter today. Our word will bring deliverance. Our word, the words of our mouth will bring healing. The words of our mouth will bring restoration. And salvation. God, I pray that we are minister of reconciliation. God, we are men and women of integrity in the name of Yeshua. We have honor. God, we have faith. We are walking in faith and the gate of us shall not prevail against us. God, we will not compromise your word. We will stand on your word. God, give your people the grace to stand on your word in Yeshua's mighty name. God, we thank you for today, God. We thank you, Lord, that you are doing mighty things in our life. God, we thank you for our careers, God, that, Lord, we are blessed even in our sphere of influence. Father, you are moving. God, you are moving, God, through us, God. You touch those who need to be touched today, God, through us in Yeshua's mighty name. And, God, we give you the praise. God, we love you. We thank you. Thank you for waking us up. Thank you for the gift of life. Thank you for salvation of our soul. God, we thank you. We honor you, God. And we declare that this is the day that the Lord has made. God, we shall rejoice. God, we declare that today we are blessed. Today we prosper. Today we walk in divine health and healing in Yeshua's mighty name. Thank you, Father. And Lord, before we leave this morning, we want to lift up this nation before you. God, we pray for America. God, we pray that America will be saved. We pray that America will know you. God, we pray that the gate of hell shall not prevail against this nation. God, be with our leaders. God, give them wisdom. God, change them. God, deliver them from the influence of the devil. Deliver them from the control of Satan. God, let them hear your voice, God. Let our leader hear your voice, God. God, let them turn from their wickedness, God. Let them lead for God, God. Lord, we commit our leaders into your hands today. Father, we pray even the senators the congressmen, the congresswomen. God, we pray for the president of this nation. God, we pray, Father, that you will touch them. God, we pray, Father, that they will do your will. They will not do the will of the devil in the mighty name of Yeshua. God, we pray for all the nations of the world. Father, we pray for your gospel to go forth. We pray for your word to run swiftly. Let your word be glorified in the nations of the earth. God, we declare the glory of the Lord. God, let your knowledge cover the sea, God, as the water cover the sea. Father, we pray for your knowledge to cover the whole earth as the water cover the sea in the name of Yeshua. We bless the Lord today. We give God the praise. We love you, Father. We bless your name. Thank you, Lord, that today, Father, we are walking in dominion. We are walking in victory and we prevail in Yeshua's mighty name. Thank you, Father, in Jesus' name. God bless you for watching this morning. Remember that it is it is through us meditating on the word of God, studying the word of God that we will prosper. Amen. So let us let us make it as a top priority to be people of the word of God, to study the word of God, to meditate on the word of God. Amen. The Bible said in the book of John 16, Jesus said that, you know, Jesus said, John, let me read it quickly. It actually is John 15. It says, I am the true vine and my father is the vine dresser. 
Every branch in me that does not bear fruit, it takes away. And every branch that bear fruit, it prunes, that it may bear more fruit. Amen. And it says, Abide in me, and I in you. And, uh, and as a branch cannot bear fruit on itself unless it abide in the vine. Amen. And he, and the six said, if anyone does not abide in me, is cast out, and a branch is withered, and they are gathered and thrown into the fire. He says, abide in me, and my words abide in you. You will ask whatever you desire, and it shall be done for you. When we abide in the word of God, we allow Yeshua or the word of God to 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 abide in us. The uh, the Bible says that whatever we desire, when we ask, it shall be done for us. Amen. So God bless you. God be with you. And I pray that today, that today is blessed. You will have a productive day today. In Yeshua's mighty name. Amen. God bless.